actually there is no specific specific point for the real estate sector. There are reforms globally from an economic standpoint. And uh, first, uh, there is um, a reduction in the corporate income tax rate, and this reduction will be spread over the coming years. So now the uh, corporate income tax rate is 33% and one third and in uh, 2022 it will be only 25 percent. Uh, we could bet that uh, this uh, reduction in corporate income rate will have a, a positive impact on the French economy and then as a consequence it could have a right impact uh, on the real estate uh, sectors. Um, um, beside that, uh, there are also uh, good uh, points regarding the uh, reduction in the distribution of uh, dividends. So uh, also it's a global uh, measure that was uh, taken, uh, but uh, not only for real estate aspect. On the wrong side, uh, I would say that um, uh, Macron decided uh, the, to um, uh, abolish the wealth tax, but uh, he maintained the wealth tax for the real estate. So uh, for French investors uh, and for non-French investors, for foreign investors, it has uh, an impact uh, because you have to pay this wealth tax if you own real estate in France. Um, regarding the other reforms that are not still voted, but they are legal reform, they are not a tax reform, uh, we could see that uh, there are some measures that uh, will be taken uh, to uh, ease the sale, to ease the development, to ease the uh, construction, the buildings uh, of uh, real estate in France.